You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime, plain and simple. Well, you're joking, right? This is a joke. Yeah, you're playing hey, a joke on me. Mallory, right? tell Fadig his cousin is okay. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Of course. Now listen. You did good with the business the other day. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskovsky jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done differently. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So? Jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a beating. Let him know might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! Bushel! Easy, Wait. buddy. Did you hear Go on. Do what you gotta do. But remember, you see a cop? You don't know me. I see anyone, I don't know you. Ho, ho! Hello. Vlad говорит. Да, да. Что ты хочешь? Быстрее. Я очень занят. Message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me! You want me to ram you? I'll ram you off the road! You got me! You got me, okay? Why have you not paid Vlad the money you owe him? I'm going to. I've just been having the trouble getting it together. Vlad is an impatient man. You will be getting the money to him soon, or your wife shall be using your washing machines to get the blood out of your clothes. Do you understand? I do not ask twice for a favor. I understand. I will get it to her. I thought this country was different. Ah. I spoke to the laundry mat owner. He gets the message. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yokel you are with your mom and your mom. Huh? Come back to the bar soon. Traffic flows more efficient on the road. Запомни, если хочешь делать деньги, приходи работать для меня. Йокол, there you are. Okay. Glad. Come on, let's go for a walk, okay? Right. Okay. Come on. I don't even like. 
Where are we going? To my car. Why? Because of your cousin. What? Owe me a lot of money, and until he pays me, you're fresh off the boat. Excuse yeah, your ass is mine. What the fuck you mean, why? Hey, you are a pretty relaxed guy, huh, Vlad? Come on. But I mean, just start I mean, I mean, Come on, Yoko. What's wrong with you? You gonna Watch jump it, me? No, I had a late night last night. Spent yeah. it with Mikhail. I don't know what Great. Yeah, no yeah, wild. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. That's so who the hell one. is Mikhail? Hey, Mikhail's a man. Shit, my nose is bleeding. Is my nose bleeding? No, not yet. Fuck this. Come on. Wait! I'm walking hey, here. Wait the fuck Let's go. Up. Damn city, always trying to run you down, huh? Hey man, can I Get that job, hey, you deadbeat crackhead! Just a little change, uh, man! Man, hey, where do these people whoa, get off? Whoa, whoa. Like I'm gonna pay for their drug habits. Well, say something! You are so fucking laid back! Moron! Come on! Want some? Good. We walked all the way over here so you could snort coke? No, listen! Ah, uh, that's better. Huh? That's better. Man, Michael gets the good stuff. It's got some laxative in it, though. Gives you a stomach problem. <laughs> nice detail. Yeah, listen, uh, where were we? I don't know. Oh, yeah. So, I need you to head up to Duke's and get a car for me. It's a silver blister. And it's packed in the project by EIC subway station. Okay? Sure. <laughs> you yeah. got keys? Uh, no, Yokel. I need you to take the car. Asko owes Mikhail some money. Take his car instead, huh? We gonna <laughs> drive over there? What? Are we gonna drive over there? No. You're gonna take the train, buddy. You think I wanna be in the car with the peasant? Come on. I'm gonna go meet somebody. <laughs> Have a little <Okay>. party. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Have bye, fun, bye. dickhead. You should not do that to me! This car belonged to Vlad. No, it's Ma. Who asked you? It belongs to Vlad now. You should pay your debts. You that fat Russians, bitch? Just try and take.
have your new car, Vlad. It's not pretty, though. Real dirty. Dirty? I can't sell a dirty car. I know you cousins like them dirty. Maybe your whole yokel family drives around in a dirty car, but it's not the way over here. Fucking peasants don't do nothing right. Hey, I could fuck this car up worse than a little dirt. Relax, man. You should lose your age. There's a car wash over on Saratoga Avenue. Just to take it over there, and then to my lockup, just a mohawk. Did they keep the car up easy? He's a little bruised, but he gave it up easy enough. Good. Dead guys can't be injured. You are dirty. answer phone message. Be leaving a recording for me after the part has been played. I put the car in your locker. You're not as stupid as you look, Yokel. Come back to see me at the bar soon. Hey. Are you trying to start this something with me? What's up, I've got to stop doing that. What the fucking fuck? Hey, how you doing? Hey, 
Hey, Mickey. What do you have? Glass of water. Glass of water. Bang, bang, you are dead. Wake up, you moron. You got me. Come over here. Sit down. You remember Ivan? No. Guy you saw me talking to. This guy. Uh, this guy. Oh, yes. You guys had the little kiss. Very funny. What would you say if I told you he was going to rob you, cousin? I'd say, what problem has he got with my cousin? Hold on. Hey. Hey, hey, gorgeous. No, I can't talk right now. What are you wearing? No, I mean underneath it. Great. Listen, I'll call you back, huh? Sorry. Who was that? Never you mind. Was it Ivan? Ooh, that's funny. You know, for a dumb yokel, you're a very funny guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and for an annoying dick, you're really an annoying dick. Well, it's a real shame then that I'm the guy with the powerful friends, and you're the little punk whose only friends is some fat weasel who drives a fucking cab! So, why is Ivan going to rob my cousin? Because I want you to kill him. What? He's angered Mikhail, Mr. Faustin. Offended him. He think he's stealing some paperwork from her mom. You catch him and kill him. Then we say it was just a robbery that failed. And what if I say I don't want to be your hitman? <laughs> that Mr. Faustin will be very angry with you. And your cousin. Hmm. Okay. I knew we would understand each other once I put it in this simple way. Now! Go wait for him by the car depot. Hey, gorgeous. Yeah, where were we? Okay, now listen. Let's talk about tonight. Ivan, let's do this. Where are you going to? to sweat. Shit! Vlad don't like you no more, man. There's nothing in this town. Don't do this for him! Nowhere left for you to run. Ah! Please, 
Vlad told you to kill me, right? I wasn't stealing nothing from your cousin's place. No one's going to know that I'm alive, not even my mother. I'll Get up. Once you're dead, you can't be all bad. Stay out of Hove Beach. Thank you. You won't regret this, man. I am out of here. Wanted to live anyway, get away from all these people from back home? Get into the real America. You're never gonna see me around here again. I owe you my life, man. You're a good man. You're a good man. Thank you. You won't be seeing your boyfriend Ivan no more. Oh, are you going to miss him? No, I'm not. I'm getting enough pussy at the moment. I tell you, it's so much better if women already have a man, because you don't have to deal with all this shit all day. Take Mallory, for example. Fuck you! You say this to my face and I will break you! Roman, how's it going? You know, cousin, things have been looking up since you got here. If things are looking up now, I hate to think what they were like before I arrived. <laughs> I hear you're working with little Jacob. He's a good man, Nico. A good man. I can't tell what he's saying most of the time, but I like him. That is your bad English, Nico. Once you've been in America for longer, you will understand him perfectly. Sure I will, Roman. Later on. with you.